Brett Kennedy with KQ2 Sports here. We're going to start something a little new this week with a brand new weekly web series called Kennedy's Conquerors. We're going to take a look at the last week and see who really conquered the week on the field. This could be an athlete coming through in a clutch situation to help their team win. It could be a team coming through in a pivotal moment of the game to come out with the victory or even a coach or an athlete showing good sportsmanship on the field or on the sideline as well. And we're going to pick a couple of these to run every week. And as this series progresses, you can go ahead and email me with some ideas, whether you have a video of somebody or a picture of somebody to run in that week's edition of Kennedy's Conquerors. You can go ahead and email me on B Kennedy at KQ2.com. But let's go into the first edition of this week's Kennedy's Conquerors. Back on September 11th, the Benton Cardinals high school volleyball team hosted East Buchanan, and this was a great match to watch. East Buchanan came out swinging on the road and took a 2-1 to one lead. Backed into a corner, Benton held tough. Junior Cammie Peters and company led the Lady Cardinals to a 25-23 fourth set victory to force a deciding fifth set. Benton would emerge out of that as well. Senior Andrea Simmons slams it home for the match point, and Benton survived to win a crazy match 3-2 to get to 7-0 on the season at that point. Congrats, Benton Volleyball. You are a Kennedy Conqueror. For our next Conqueror, we go to high school softball. On September 17th, Plattsburgh hosted Gallatin, with the Lady Bulldogs coming in at 4-0. Plattsburgh jumped out to a 6-1 lead, but back-to-back -back home runs from Kerry Don Jones and Shani McBroom in the fourth, and a Bryn Bird two-run RBI double in the sixth made it a one-run Plattsburgh lead at 6-5. Bottom of the inning, Plattsburgh junior Sophie Schmitten steals second. The throw is high and into the outfield. Schmitten comes in to score to make it 7-5 now. Gallatin then loaded the bases in the top of the seventh, but Lady Tigers junior pitcher Penelope Arazeri gets Gallatin to pop up at the end of the game. Plattsburgh hangs on to win and gives Gallatin its first loss, 7-5. Lady Tigers, you are a Kennedy Conqueror. The final Kennedy Conqueror is in college football. On September 14th, Northwest Missouri State, looking for its first win, hosted the 25th ranked Fort Hayes State Tigers. Bearcats junior quarterback Chris Runke really stepped up. He finished 33 of 41 passing for 273 yards and two touchdowns. He did throw three interceptions, but his late touchdown to Wintrick Williams the third at the beginning of the fourth quarter sealed the victory. Runke's 33 completions in a game finished tied for second all time in school history. Chris Runke, you are a Kennedy Conqueror. Again, if you see any other Kennedy Conquerors in the coming weeks that you want to see on our web series, make sure to email me at bkennedy at kq2.com. Brett Kennedy, KQ2 Sports.